It's First Coast News on your side. It is incredible that I survived. The search is on tonight for a hit and run driver who crashed into a college student as she was heading to work. The 23 year old survivor is not holding back about this crash that flipped her car a half a dozen times. Rick Boone is on your side tonight to help get a reckless driver off of our roads. This was an amazing situation. It happened to this young driver. It happened in a matter of seconds, but she says it felt like hours. Her being bounced around inside this vehicle, not knowing if she would make it out alive. My seatbelt was jammed, so I was trying to figure out, like, how do I get out of this? How do I get out of my car? My next thoughts was my car might catch on fire. 23-year-old Jalen Binyard considers herself a safe driver and believes most others are too, but last Sunday north of downtown, she found out not everyone is. It is just sad that someone will hit you and leave you for pretty much dead. While traveling along 95 North, just past the Gulf Air exit, she says the male driver of a black Camry slammed twice into her vehicle's driver's side, causing it to hydroplane and flip six times. A witness told her the Camry then sped off. I had to call out. It was a lot of people that stopped to make sure I was okay. And they were able to get the glass out of my passenger door and I was able to crawl out that way. Ben Yard's wild ride happened as she was on her way to work to care for a 93 year old. The college student is from Jacksonville, but attends FAMU as a pharmacy student. It's not known if her new medical issues will now pause her education, but she says her only real concern is that police find out who did this. And I really would not want this to ever happen to anyone else. Well, it's amazing that she uh, she made it out of that to uh, tell her story with us tonight. Now, police are still looking for more clues in this case. You can go to firstcoastnews.com if you have any video or information about this crash that sent Ben Yard's car flying. Uh, anything you have, anything you can add will be helpful. We're in Jacksonville. Rick Boone, First Coast News on your side.